get an X-ray done, there's a good possibility that you have a cough. Because it's so recurrent that it goes like that. You're a doctor, aren't you? Yeah, could you hear that cough? <laughs> <laughs> now look coccus and corallium and you tell me which one is this look at coccus cacti and corallium rubrum coccus cacti and corallium rubrum in corallium rubrum it is written it's a machine gun cough <laughs> you see hear the cough you heard this cough right yeah you heard this cough it's a corallium rubrum cough okay it should get definitely next week afterwards. Only I have given one dose, uh, two doses of coronium rubrum. That's it. Two doses of 200? It's a tuberculosis. Tuberculosis. Yes, because he spent the first five minutes coughing. Yeah, the whole concentration is coughing. Yeah. You see, it feels like that, you know, that these, all these patches, these are the, you know, fibrotic lesions in the, in the lab. And you could see there is quite an extension of the lesion. This is... This is one month, one month before, one is 6th of February. Amazing. You know, he's, 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 this is a real acute follow-up we have seen and advanced pathology. We are talking about an open tuberculosis. They give uh, streptomycin injection, this and that, you know. If he stays like this, within generally within two weeks, he becomes a closed case. Closed? Yeah. He becomes a closed case. I mean, you, you can't believe wha how he was coughing last week. Yeah. And with streptomycin, it's six months or nine months. Yeah, yeah. they gave nine months. So he stopped everything, just having my own. Burst open. How many days have you been here? I Within 24 to 48 hours, it no bath any kitchen. Clean burst open, and it discharges. Mukhe mukhe modre pusta beroish. It discharge pass in the mouth. In a in a situation like this, you ask about the discharge. We are we are getting recurrent. So what we are getting homeopathically recurrent formation of say boil in our terminology. Recurrent formation of boil. Alright? So, where you will prescribe? So, basically, what homeopathically you are getting? Suppurative. You got to think of a suppurative medicine. It happened four times in six months. And he's fed up of that. Right? No. He hasn't taken any conventional medicine. And the second is staphylococcin. Staphylococcin is prepared from Staphylococcus aureus. So any past discharge which is recurrent, Staphylococcin is a good start to break the vicious cycle. You are with me? Staphylococcin. So boil in the upper palate. What are you doing? Oh, you have good luck. Hundred yeah. percent better. Have a look. Sure. Stack up. You saw this? Yeah, I remember. Staphylococcin was given. You know, very contagious, and generally, by looking, you know, this is from my experience. Looking at this, this is a typical case of scabies. 
chronic obstructive pulmonary disorder early morning aggravation ভালো <laughs> He saw this case, 29. He also has asthma. Asthma. Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Kelly was given if you recall because one of the catch was weakness of arsenic and Kelly and asthma. Aggression to কেমন আছে along with fever and aggression at night. Why didn't the swelling still there? You know, it was huge. It was like this, you know? So swelling and pain in all the joints. Swelling and pain in all the joints. Followed by aggravation first motion. Better continued motion. Aggravation first motion, better continued motion. Aggravation winter motion, better warm application. Aggravation new moon full motion. So remember, aggravation first motion, better continued motion. Aggravation new moon full motion, better warm, chilly patient. New moon full moon, strong new moon full moon. I said to check it. Whenever you will find that new moon full moon aggravation, quite strongly present. And it is there for, you know, for some period of time. With the same Rastrox modality. Go for Calcarea Florica. This is called homeopathy, dear. This is called homeopathy. No, 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 no. You must be proud you are studying this. Joint pains, 100% there. And you see, the patient has improved so well. You can hardly see that. It's a good case. So it was just here that... What did you say? Yes, yes. 
They were much more prominent, but it's the same. Yeah. 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 You understand how I took the weakness? Grief, disappointment of love on the one hand, affecting the body. I always want you to understand this. On the one hand, the etiology. On the one hand is the etiology, on the other hand is the manifestation. Okay, and the manifestation is weakness in phosphoric acid. It's a mental weakness, physical weakness, gastric weakness, sexual weakness, urinary weakness also have. We have polyuria in phosphoric acid. Polyuria. And also we have dermatological weakness, skin weakness. All right? Thank you, Acme. And that's about your phosphoric acid. We have destruction, degeneration. Marasm is a subject which is many times kept in a box. We study marasms of the person. Clear? So what are the three areas? The first area was the gesture and posture. The second area is the personality. And the third area is the temperament. Watch telly for seven days. Whereas in that same seven days, Mr. Psychosis will go for gambling to Las Vegas. Well, I'll just quickly go through it. This is something I'd just like to share with you. There's a patient who came uh, who came who was 23 the diagnosis is headache, vomiting, dysarthria. Dysarthria, you know? Dysarthria, sliding of the speech. Progressive right hemiparesis. Given the diagnosis of brain tumor with headache, CT study reveals an irregularly enhanced cystic midline SOM. Generally, when it is irregular, that's quite tricky. If there's a possible, like irregular is in homeopathy, miasmatically cephalitic. There's a, she's 23, losing all her hope, given the diagnosis of brain tumor, apathetic. Discernings are lethargic. It was my best case in my life, 30 years of my practice, this is the best case. And a case of astrocytoma, 